World Health Summit, held each autumn in Berlin, Germany, with regional meetings taking place at locations worldwide. The first such meeting in Japan was held in April 2015 at the Kyoto International Conference Center with a satellite symposium at Fukushima Medical University addressing the topics of rapidly aging societies, disaster preparedness, and fostering new leaders. The main meeting, hosted by Kyoto University's School of Public Health, had over 600 attendees from 25 countries over the course of two days of lively presentations and discussions. And Japan is such a, an important country and has had uh, major influence actually on the health development and has very specific problems also. We have to educate new leaders and get them involved and I think it's a fantastic uh, experience being here in Japan learning from the Japanese experience for the world. Academia really cares about global issues affecting human lives. We feel a strong social responsibility in creating a new medicine uh, to meet the needs of a new era. And particularly, we feel responsibility to producing uh, future leaders uh, uh, to attack the challenge uh, of uh, rapid changing demographic uh, structure and the healthcare needs. I think it means people coming together to address the big issues that are facing the world in terms of health. Uh, from, from people who work primarily doing clinical work to basic science to people who work in many countries uh, trying to improve health. The regional meeting allows a focus on the problems of a particular region and area and it's really exciting to be here in Japan to be able to focus on the challenges of the ageing society and developing our next generation of academic leaders. It's been fun, you know, to learn about the latest in the whole field of uh, medicine uh, and uh, population health from basic sciences, infectious disease, uh, dealing with disaster, dealing with population aging. You'll never sort of see a meeting like this where they cover the whole waterfront. And I think learning from the Japanese experience is uh, valuable not just for Japan but also for the rest of the world. So Japan has the opportunity to provide leadership in its response, uh, in its health system's response to a rapidly aging population in the face of the disasters uh, she's also experienced in areas such as Fukushima. I appreciated having the multiple sectors uh, represented here in free and open conversations and am going away with a great deal more to think about uh, than I um, perhaps had in my head coming in, always the sign of a good meeting. I think it's a great platform and especially uh, to give the opportunity to young researchers like us. I had the opportunity to be able to present um, some of my work and to be able to get um, the feedback from the um, senior uh, researchers.
Regional Meetings Satellite Symposium at Fukushima Medical University was attended by over 450 students and members of academia and the health sector. The meeting concluded with a joint Fukushima statement calling on leaders worldwide to improve responsiveness and resilience in the wake of the 2011 earthquake, tsunami, and nuclear disaster, which presented immense challenges for local health systems, already struggling to cope with aging communities. Health is one of the most important. That's what we are devoted to. We are all cordially invited to contribute to this noble cause. Thank you very much and thank you everybody here in Japan. Thank you. <laughs>